Sookie, I am back. And Hannah had a great question. You know, like, was it a chiropractic school or was it a mortuary school? I think that is so cool. And the answer is no, it was not a mortuary school. And you guys might be able to tell me, but I'm pretty sure it was a chiropractic school. It was in the Chicago area and they had cadavers and high school students could come in and I had high school students. Duh. So my high school students got on the bus with me and we went to the school and we went in and you guys, you know who you are. You dissected human bodies that were like laying down there. I guess they had like three or four. I don't really remember, but I do know that Veronica held a brain in her hands and she was, oh, she was awesome. And I didn't do that. I, I just took my kids to do that, okay? Um, but they got the, they loved it. And every year, that's what we did. We studied all the, all the semester, all the different organs and everything. And they did a good job because they knew at the end of that semester, they would get to dissect a cat. And they all looked forward to cat dissection. And at the end of that, Oh my goodness, we had a trip to this chiropractic school where they would be able to handle cadavers. So I think science is an awesome subject to teach. I think more people should teach it and it needs to be incorporated into everyday life because I would tell my kids in anatomy and physiology Everybody has a body and they need to understand deeply how that body is made and how it works. And even if they don't need it, they will go on to have children. And when they need to take care of their children, they need to understand how their children's bodies are made and how they work. Okay, goodbye.